Pag Now, nasa- paano kung yung isa doon hindi pumasok? Like, check lahat. Chemistry, check. Compatibility, check. Commitment, check. Kaso, physical appearance, so-so. Like, again, it's a matter of preference na. So, that can be an attraction. Sometimes, whether there are women who are attracted to non-good-looking people. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Pangit. So, pangit. <laughs> Non-good-looking diba? people. Hey, pangit. Ang ganda, ganda pa. Para sa pangit. Diba? Oh. Pangit po ibig sabihin. Yeah. Oh. Welcome to the Timawa Podcast. And this podcast is all about men empowerment. Really empowering men to move to their next level in terms of their finances, health, relationship, career, and really encouraging people and especially men to improve their life from being a timawa or mediocre to become the alpha of their own life. And for this episode, grabe. Excited ah, ako dito sa episode natin, guys. Grabe talaga. First time namin. First na ever. First, first ever. First ever. ever guest, no? Mm-hmm. Ng timawa podcast. No? And ito, sobrang, ano, sobrang idol tong guest natin. Oh. Yes. Tong guest natin na to, uh, actually, mm-hmm. short, ano lang, no? Background. Sure, sure. Kaya ako to na meet. Okay. Is, uh, hindi, kaya ako siya nakilala, no? Mm-hmm. Is because, meron akong time dati nagla-live ako sa TikTok. Okay. Tapos, uh, sabi nung, may mga nagko-comments, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. sabi nila, Uy, ano, ang ganda ng contents nyo. Kasi about finances eh. Mm. Collab naman kayo ni Ma'am Antoinette. Yeah. yeah. So, ang dami, ang dami ganoon. Ma'am okay. Antoinette Aquino, Ma'am Antoinette Aquino. So, chine ko si, sino ba ito si Antoinette Aquino? Mm-hmm. Pag-search ko, wow. wow. Kaya naman pala. Grabe. Grabe. Super quality content mm-hmm. about finances. Yep. Valuable. Kasi yep. ako, even ako talaga, mm-hmm. pinapanood ko yung mga contents niya. Mm-hmm. And I'm learning a lot. Yeah. No? And, grabe, no? talagang beauty and brains. Mm. Di ba? Tapos, nung na-meet ko siya, nung isang PR sa, ay, ayoko sabihin yung Basta, brand. Basta, sa isang Basta. event. Basta, hashtag, baka naman. Uy, yung brand mo. Uy, yung brand mo. Baka hindi tayo masponsoran. Yan, yan, yan. Tago mo yan, tago mo yan. So, nung na-meet ko siya doon, ay, sabi ko, certified. Certified Timawa to. Ano? Kala ko certified TikToker eh. Certified TikToker. Hindi, ano siya, kumbaga parang ano siya, very, very humble. Agree. Sobrang down to earth. Sobrang simple. Mm-hmm. Eh, madali siyang maka-jive. Yeah, no? correct. Uh, actually, first time lang namin itong makakausap talaga siya. Kasi, syempre, nung PR, parang mm. hindi naman tayo masyado nakapag-usap mm. talaga doon. Chika-chika yeah. lang. Parang small talk lang, ganyan, plastikan. Alam mo mm. naman, buhay. <laughs> diba? Showbiz. Showbiz. Ganun lang pala. Wala, we're friendly. Yeah. We're friendly, <laughs> di ba? Ganyan ang mga ano. So, jolly-jolly. Hindi, jolly. joke lang. Pero ngayon, ngayon ka namin talaga makikilala. Yeah. Right. At marami kaming mga questions for you. Mm-hmm. Uh, and, but, Uh, this topic is really all about uh, educating men, no? Um, ano ba yung mga red flags yeah. ng mga lalaki? Yeah. Sa mga red flags. Siyempre kasi sa mga timawa, mga lalaki, kung gusto nyo mo, sino ba namang ayaw magkaroon ng girlfriend or partner na kasing ganda ni Tony? Ayun, kasing bait naman. ni Tony. Kasing, kasing talino ni Tony. Sheesh. Kasing successful ni Tony. Ah, sino ba naman ang ayaw? Siyempre, lahat yan. Ngayon, paano natin Gusto. ma-attract yung ganyang klaseng babae? Pa, paano yan. nga ba? Eh, siyempre, mm-hmm. very, very mm-hmm. important na walang red flags. Tapat. Ah. Diba? Or minimize. 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 Oh. Pero bago, natin pumunt- bago tayo pumunta sa topic na yan, siyempre, kilalanin muna natin ang guest natin for today. Yan. Yeah. Diba? Palakpakan naman natin. Antoine Pacino, welcome, welcome Very to the show. Very kind introduction. Lapit mo kay Tony yung mic niya. Yeah, yeah, lapit, lapit, yeah, lapit. Yeah. 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 Thank you for that, Hap. I almost believe what you said. Mahinabi, lapit ka pala. Lapit ka, lapit ka. Yeah, yeah. As, in, as in ganyan. Medyo, huwag mo lang i-kiss, ha. Huwag mo lang i-kiss, Tony. Okay, okay. Yeah, so, um, again, thank you for inviting me here mm-hmm. sa podcast. It's an honor to be your first guest. <laughs> and of course, to be talking about this topic. Kasi, First time ko din, you know, to tackle something like this. It's always finance. Mm-hmm. But I'm glad to be having this discussion with all of nice. you. Nice. Know? Yeah. Thank you very much, Tony, for saying yes. Yan. Na mag-guest ka sa podcast namin. Grabe, sobrang isang, ano ko lang chat kay Tony. Mm-hmm. G ka agad siya, no? So, thank you very much. Thank you. Na-excited kaming uh, mas makilala ka, no? Mm-hmm. Um, sino nga ba si Tony? Sino nga ba? Parang... Parang pabuyan. Parang pabuyan. Parang pabuyan. Grabe mo tanong to. Sige, sige, sige. Ilang tao ka na ba? Grabe ka naman, Tito Boy. 
Para ba ba magpapastok eh. Ba ba pastok kami. Kasi para gusto ko na emotional na kagad magkaiyak na kagad. Sino ba 'tong Sino ba 'tong kausap? Sino ba? Ole, parang beyond the brand. Beyond the brand. Gusto ko makilala yung personal side nito. Ano, Antoinette Aquino kasi to sa TikTok eh. Yes. Oo, kasi sa TikTok lang natin na behind the camera. Behind the camera. Well, I've always been associated with my brand mm-hmm. and then I guess it also had something to do with my passion for creating content. Mm-hmm. So it's because I love introverted kasi ako eh. mm-hmm. So when I want to express my feelings, when I want to talk about a certain topic besides my friends, mm-hmm. I like talking to the camera too. Mm-hmm. So that's one of things. And then um, I'm not sure if a lot of people know this too. My viewers would. It's that I'm a breadwinner of the family. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wow. Solo living mm-hmm. and single wow. but happy. Mm-hmm. At the end yung single, Tony. Yeah. Single. Single, but single parang, and ready to mingle. Na parang gusto yung emphasize. Single and no? mingling. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Nice. Nice. <laughs> Tanong John Marie. <laughs> What got you into finance? Kasi di ba, if I may ask, how, how old are you again? How old do I look? Yeah. 19. Ay, you know, 19. <laughs> <laughs> And then, seriously. I'm 22. I'm 22. 22. Mm-hmm. Yan. Di ba, mm-hmm. parang ako before when I was working in a corporate, parang nag earn ako. Mm-hmm. Pero parang hindi ako ganyan ka-deep into finance just like Tony. Mm-hmm. Ah. So, curious ako what got you into finance, into educating people around right. this. Well, I've always wanted to pursue law. Yan talaga oh. yung path that was mm-hmm. tailored fit for me because I took up Paul side tapos mm-hmm. yung dad side ng dad side, they were all like in politics, mm-hmm. in government. So, it pushed me to get into that field. Mm-hmm. But, you know, there's also a time wherein we were buried in debt. Mm-hmm. And um, I was put in an exclusive school. I'm mm-hmm. tuition fee. Eh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I knew that we couldn't pay for all of the bills. Mm-hmm. We couldn't yes. keep up with the lifestyle that we had. So that pushed me to start working mm-hmm. too. Ooh. And you know, yung financial advisor ko at that time, because mm-hmm. I, I got my f- very first insurance plan at 17. Wow. And then with my mom as a policy holder. Owner, yeah. So I already knew the value of the industry, the value mm-hmm. of what we were doing. Mm-hmm. And that's what got me interested too. So I saw it sa mentor ko. Kasi di ba, mm-hmm. dami naman talaga nag invite to join yes. naturally. But what pulled me was how my mentor stayed by my side and how she educated me all throughout. So that's what got me into finance. So at the age of 17, working student ka? Working student. Mm-hmm. Actually, 14 ako nag-start Anong work. work? Okay. And I had to falsify government documents. Mm-hmm. Para no. lang makapa... Ay, you mean, sorry, no, self-discrimination. No, 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 no. Pat na lang din. On the record. Bip na lang natin. Oo, papabip. Baka mamaya maano pa ako dito. Wala, wala, wala. wala. Um, Kami-gabi well, lang ta, guys. To, okay. I had to sort of mm-hmm. fake my way through it yeah. until... Um, eventually, I was able to get a job of my own. And mm-hmm. ayun, ayun. So, paano nga yung red flags? 14 years old. No, no 14 years old, nagdo-Dota lang ako eh. Oh. Kaya ako nag invest sa Dota. Tsaka sa Ragnarok. Ang ah, okay. dami ko na invest dyan. Walang balik. Gano'n ka kapal yung card mo? <laughs> Ragnarok. 14 years old, parang yung amoy natin nun, boss. Ano? Mm. Hindi yung makakapag-usap ng ganito. Eh, di ba? And yun nga, uh, coming from the red flags din kasi, y- taka lang, tanong ko lang, itong course mo ng college, hindi siya related Anything against about finances, diba? Balls no, not at all. Balls so, mm-hmm. I got in the industry in experience, mm-hmm. young, so, ganun talaga. So, you are in the financial services industry na ngayon? Oh. Yes, correct, correct. Okay, and okay. eventually, now, I shifted it to content creation, yeah. mm-hmm. but still in line with what we are all doing then mm-hmm. in finance. Very okay. useful then. What got you naman into do, doing content creation naman? Well, ideally, yung goal ko was to be able to democratize yung mm, financial education. Nice, nice. Right. And right. um, I saw the need for it then. Mm-hmm. And at that time, nung nag-start ako, wala pa talaga nag-tiktok about finance here in the Philippines. Mm-hmm. So yung may nakita ko, FYP in the States, yung mm-hmm. they were talking mm-hmm. about you know, everything. Sa TikTok yan, di ba? Yeah, mm-hmm. sa TikTok. Yeah. And then, um, I just started posting content that I think would mm-hmm. um, help yung kabataan pala. Yeah. And then eventually, nag-grow yung audience. Dang. And then I I kept up with the trends. Mm-hmm. And so did the following and the branding. Okay. So, kailan to nag-start? Anong year? 20? 
20, early 2020. Yan. Pandemic oh, na. Oo, oh, oh, pandemic no. din. Bored ka, no? Wala kang magawa. Oh, One lane class. Na Usually, puro oh. kaldag lang noong mga time na yun. Eh. Oh, oh. Actually, hindi ko nga sinat. <laughs> puro puro kaldag pa lang noong mga time Saka na yun. Saka lagit na eh. ni DJ Luño. Oh, no. Yung content na kami to ni 2020, pero DJ Luño. Kumakaldag pa siya. <laughs> okay, like, Pero ikaw during that time, finances na yung ano mga talaga. Oo, so, oh, oh, finances. Ah, and then, right, right. di ko sinabi, like, I didn't tell anyone until like, mm-hmm. hit yung mga 50k followers na, na yeah. nakita ng friends ko. Uh-huh. Their FYP. Galing, galing. And, yun. Ano ba, sa iyo ba, para medyo pinagtripan ka ba nila nung umpisa na nag-content ka? Kasi ako nung first time ko na ganyan, mm. niluluko talaga ako ng mga trobo. Uy, si coach, si coach. TikToker. 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 Oh, ikaw ba may ganun ka ganun din. And, and medyo, I also had that self-limiting belief. Mm. Yung parang, I didn't want to put myself out there yet. Yeah, yeah. Until I realized that, you know, what I'm doing actually benefits a lot of people. So why not share it to more? Mm. Correct. And then bigla na lang more financial, mm-hmm. uh, financial advisors got mm-hmm. into TikTok too. And then, diba? Look what we're, that's why I'm here now in front of you. Talking yeah. to all of you. Yeah. Right? Would not be possible without TikTok. Correct. Correct. So, isa ka pala sa mga naging trendsetter no? when it comes to financial mm-hmm. education content. Hindi naman. I, I, I'd like to think so, but I don't think it was mm-hmm. just me too. Mm-hmm. So, it was everyone who really consistently put out content yeah. on that platform. That Dalawa sila ni Chinkitan talaga nagdidigitan dyan. <laughs> <laughs> palitan, palitan. palitan. <laughs> si Chinkitan, ito si Tony. Oh, di kita niyan dati. Di, di, di ganyan eh. Okay. <laughs> Ching positive. Uh, <laughs> idol yan. Shout out idol. Sana mga yeah, August yeah, namin, idol Ching Kita. Chos, baka na naman. Solid yan, solid yan. So anyway, napunta na tayo ngayon sa topic. Karabi. Mm. Ano? Sobrang green flag neto. Kasi at such a young age, very responsible. Yeah, oh. Imagine mo naman, 14 years old. Ano yung ano mo? Anong kapintasan mo, Tony? Share mo naman yung kapintasan mo. What's kapintasan? Meron ka bang floss? What's kapintasan? We don't know that. What's kapintasan? Sorry, may floss ka ba? Siyempre, madami. I'm just very good at hiding. Oh, okay, okay. Branding. According to the use word, sabi niya. Sige, pag-usapan natin ngayon yung relationship. no? Yes. So, siyempre, gusto namin ma-share sa mga listeners natin, no? mga timawa, na gustong magkaroon ng girlfriend na kagyan. Yeah. Oh, diba? At very, very powerful. Age, oh, diba? Gumagrind, mm-hmm. hustling at a very young age. Yeah. Tapos pinagsasabay ang pag-aaral, pag-work, mm-hmm. very successful, very empowered. Yes. Um, and syempre, very pretty. Diba? Mm-hmm. Complete package talaga to si Tony. Correct, Tama. correct. Pero syempre, para matulungan natin yung mga listeners natin. Yan. We wanna eliminate for sure yung mga red flags. Diba? Mm-hmm. Para at least magkaroon sila ng chance sa hagaya mo. Mm-hmm. Diba? For you ba? Um, ano yung mga red flags for you sa mga lalaki? On, from what stage muna? Kasi may, may mga phases dun. Right? Before ah, you sige. get into us. Oh, Educate us. Madaming Educate red us with flags but mm-hmm. in different phases. Meron din mga orange flags. Ay, oh, ay gano'n. May ganun pala. Oh, ito yung alam. I love it. Green. Then green lang ako. This is rainbow flags. So yung topic like natin. Rainbow flags, you know. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, mabot pala ito yung violet. Yeah. I guess let's start with indigo. <laughs> indigo. Let's go. Let's go for indigo, Tony. What's the indigo flag? Sige, sige. Then sige. Do tayo sa phase one. Phase one. Phase one. Phase one. Phase one. Uh, so, yeah. ano yung, ano yung, hindi, well, define muna natin what, what is the phase one or the first stage. Yeah. Like, getting to know pa lang. Uh, Ganun ba yun? Hindi kasi diba may talking stage. Yeah. Pero meron din pre-talking stage. Ah, may pre-talking stage. Yung chat okay. muna. Yung prospecting natin. Ay, so, oh. yun yung pag-swipe right mo sa Bumble. Correct, yeah, no? correct, correct. Yeah. correct. Yeah. Pwede, pwede. Or just by mutual friends. Siyempre, yeah. mag-interview. Oh, okay, kasi yeah. ganito. Mm, okay, okay. okay. Correct. History nito. Yeah. Ayan. So, ano yung mga red flags dyan? From there, you can spot already, like one, the first thing that came on top of mind okay. is if the person is fresh off from a relationship. Mm. It, it's red. Actually, red flag orange flag siya. Okay. Orange. Parang, you don't have to drop the person, okay. but you wait muna. Wait. Yeah. Wait lang. Mag- oh. Lulutuin. Kasi ba? Mag- Lulutuin. Oh. Lulutuin mo pa. Tingnan natin kung persistent ka. Ganun. Oh. Oo, okay. parang ganun mm-hmm. din. And you just, you just know that if you enter into that relationship, or with that person. Mm. Bakit siya orange flag for you? Orange flag because the person isn't ready yet to enter into a serious relationship. Mm-hmm. So chances are, you're either a rebound. Rebound. Mm-hmm. Diba? Or you're just someone that he can play around with until mm-hmm. ready na siya. 
Nasa, nasa so, healing process pa kasi. Oo, oh, oh, nasa okay. healing process. So, orange yun for me. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yung ibang girls, ano yung mag-aano sa... So, naguguluhan ako. So, yung red flag is talagang <laughs> tayo, tayo X na. Tayo lang to. Uh-huh. Yeah, Hindi like X na. Yeah. Yung orange. Yung orange. 50-50. Oh, yeah. yeah. Parang yes. you're just Then, one foot in. Oh, one right. foot in. Huwag okay. muna mag Medyo may hold back ng konti. Oh, okay. 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 Balik ah. Alam mo din ay kilala niya. Tatlo lang sa bro. Red lang to. Red. Pero kada pa para sa traffic light lang. Ano ba 'to? Alam. Dami nang ano nito. Kasi dito na kasi to, hindi to Gen Z. Ay, lang Gen Z dito. Dami nang na kasi, you know. Check natin. Ah sige. So, yun yung number one, no. Pagka fresh from ano, um relationship. So, orange pa yan, medyo malamala. Pancha-tancha lang, malamala pa, di ba? Okay. Okay. Sige. So, paano mo malalaman pala from there, like, ano ba to? Na-ready na siya? Or green flag na siya? Nagta-transition ba yan? May ano ka ba dyan? Ano, paano mo masabi yun? Uh, Siyempre, we don't put our eggs in one basket. Mm-hmm. Parang so, investment lang. Mm-hmm. Oh, Correct. Oh, diba? Connected pa rin yan. Of course. Diba? Diba? Yan, no? So, why would you settle for one already? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. You can go out in the market. It's still uh-huh. open for you. Uh-huh. So, dun mo malalaman yeah. din, you know, who you want as uh-huh. a partner. You right. explore. You start right. to filter out the men. Correct. Oh, ganun. Oh, All right. Tama but that's, that's for me. Uh-huh. I don't know about how men do it. If yeah. they like to, you tell me. Actually, um, ganun din. <laughs> <laughs> Wala nang masabi. Wala nang masabi. Ito na explanation niya. Ako, oh, I like that. I agree. I agree. I agree. Ay, wala nang may orange flag pala eh. Anyway, sige. Uh-huh. Parang G ka lang ng G. <laughs> Puro green flag sa akin. <laughs> Standards G. yan. Standards. G agad. Oh, G agad. Okay. Anyway, hindi kasi magkaiba kasi yung ano talaga ng parang nga para o, oh, ng lalaki sa babae. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, would you agree, ito Tony, napag-usapan namin ng previous episode namin, would you agree that yung mga guys, na-attract sila sa, lala, sa babae based on their, number one is for, for sure, physical appearance. Mm-hmm. Right. But mm-hmm. women is not just into physical appearance, but more mm-hmm. on social value. More on, may pangarap ba to? May sense ba to kausap? Ver- at, for, at first ba to yung sinasabi mo? Hindi, in general. Anong, anong phase? In general. In general. Ah, Attraction okay. is early stage siya ng ligawan eh. Okay. Ng courtship, mm. Sobrang diba? simplified for you men, no? It's just attraction and then social value. But then mm. for us women, apat siya. Uy, uy. Apat. Okay. 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 Makinig, guys. Ha? Makinig. No, Makinig kayo. Direct no, lagyan no, mo ng background yung mathematical <laughs> equations. <laughs> Golden nugget <laughs> here, guys. Okay, okay, naging apat. Ah. Gusto nyo ng ganito? Okay. Eto, yes, makinig kayo. Go. Okay. Go, go. First one, okay. admiration. Okay. Or attraction for you men. Yeah, yeah. Physical looks, diba? Yung mm-hmm. amoy. Mm-hmm. Yung mga ganun. Yeah, kasama yan. Oo. The second one is chemistry. Mm-hmm. or connection. Chemistry. May vibe. Ay, yung yeah, vibe mo chemistry. ba siya? But you can have chemistry with anyone. Mm-hmm. With right, your mom, right. you know, with your mm-hmm. friends. But mm-hmm. importante yun. Mm-hmm. And then yung third is commitment na. Mm-hmm. Okay. And yeah, that's the third stage. You you also test how, you know, if the person's ready for commitment, if kaya niya. But, mm-hmm. And then the last would be compatibility. Ooh. Magkaiba pa yung compatibility sa chemistry? Correct. Ano pinagkaiba nun? Chemistry, yeah. like I said, you can have chemistry with anyone, with your friends, the ba? Kahit hindi but, romantic. Oh, kahit hindi romantic. Okay. Okay. Compatibility is usually what sets it. And a lot of people would say this would be the most important. Parang sustainability oh. ng relationship. Yeah, correct. Correct. It's what Now, paano kung yung isa doon hindi pumasok? Like, check lahat. Chemistry, check. Compatibility, check. Commitment, check. Kaso, physical appearance, so-so. Like, again, it's a matter of preference na. So that can be an attraction. Sometimes there are women who are attracted to non-good-looking people. Mm-hmm. 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 Pangit. So, pangit. <laughs> <laughs> non-good-looking diba? people. Ang ganda pa rin. Pangit po ibig sabihin. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Uh, ang dami ko friends na magana sabihin, ayok pangit. Nakakatakot. Ay, ay, ayok ko ng gwapo. Sorry, sorry. Okay. Ba- baliktad. Ayok ko ng gwapo. Nakakatakot. Oh. Bakit naman? Kasi, Kasi yung pati yung pogi, di ba naluloko? Mm. Uy, doon naman. Ano ka ba? Ang pangit naman ang judgment mo sa amin. Hindi <laughs> <laughs> joke lang. Hindi <laughs> kami lahat gaba na. Ang ganun. Saan man galing yan tayo? Anyway. Hindi pa. Sumingit lang. Okay. But, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a matter of preference. Then. So, it's part of the first stage. So, it's red flag agad for you pag hindi siya pasok sa standards mo in terms of looks. Ikaw, personally. Personally, I think attraction matters. So, what exactly are you asking? 
Ang sinasabi niya kasi depende sa preference. Thank you sa pag-translate. Oh. <laughs> Hindi niya. Ano talaga <laughs> ko sa kanya? Uh-huh. So, ano kung nyari, ikaw, pasok dun sa tatlo. Again, mm. committed, uh, commitment pa so, compatibility, chemistry, pero yung looks, hindi mo siya type. Looks, hindi mo siya type. Like, hindi siya pasok sa dream guy mo. Physically. Ah, okay. That's, I think that's unrealistic already. Like what you said, wag intergalactic standards. Mm. So, the looks, oh. it's something you get used to over time din. Eh. Mm. I think men, I mean, women aren't as particular to looks compared to men. Okay. Because okay. of the whole okay. double yeah. standards. Correct. Mm-hmm. Correct. Mm-hmm. Diba? And like sometimes you just find the person attractive over time. Oh, kahit yes. hindi siya guapo by Correct. standards. Correct. So nagkaroon ka na ba ng boyfriend na not good looking? Not good. Not? Yeah. Oh, ano ba yung not? Wait, teka lang, teka lang. Teka lang, teka lang. Ano ba yung not good looking? Shout out sa inyo. Wait, ano ba yung not good looking? Yeah. So kung hindi ka good looking, subjective. Siguraduhin mong improve mo yung chemistry. Chemistry? Maging competent ka. And compatibility. Madali lang yung improve yan. Madali na yan. Sama mo na yung physics. Pwede na yan. Kayang-kaya yan. Eh, sabay mo na. Oo, oh, sabay mo na. Okay, good. Okay. At least nagkapag-asa ang mga timawa right. natin. Right. Mm-hmm. Karabi, no? Sabi sa inyo, hindi masyado importante yung looks. Pero syempre, Tama. ibang usapan yung hygiene. Di ba? Mm. Kung hindi ka na po, at least may dating ka man lang. Oh, okay. Mukha ka malinis. Mukha ka malinis. Mukha presentable. Presentable ba? Di ba? Kahit hindi ka guwapuhan. Sa mukha mabango. Mukha mabango. Yeah. At least mukha mabango. Yeah. Okay, niya. So, anyway. Siguro ako, ano, question okay, dito. Kasi ang narinig ko sa'yo is all about preference. Tsaka standards. So, How did you set this in? Paano mo to nalaman? Especially para dun sa mga timawa natin ng mga subscribers. <laughs> like, ano, was this from experience? What established your preferences, your standards para dun sa mga choice mo? Mga Red non-negotiables. Oh, yeah. mga non-negotiables mo. Okay. Mm, okay. Well, yeah, number one would be through experience. And then, you know, as a young woman too. I get a lot of mentorship in that aspect. Mm. So, madami talaga akong kinoconsult na friends, ayun, yeah. that, okay, that really help you along the way. You mm-hmm. know, who've experienced way more than I did. But yeah. I would say, I've also had a fair share of experience din naman. Um, even though I'm still young mm-hmm. by standards. But I think I've dated enough. And so far, I, I have been in serious relationships and they were always long term. Okay. Pero hindi siya madaming boyfriend. Hindi siya, hindi siya mahaba yung list. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So it, I was in a five-year relationship, three-year ah, relationship. Usually long-term talaga. Yeah, usually long-term mm-hmm. siya. Mm-hmm. Okay. And ano? Ano pang red flags? Yeah. yeah. Ano pang mga ano red pang flags? Ano pang mga red flags para Kasi kay Tony? Kasi orange flag palang naganin natin eh. Yeah. Oo, oo, oo. Red ano? flag pala. Orange red flag naman tayo. Yung mm. talagang pag nakita mo, no. Mm. Mm. Um, love bombers. Ano yun? Oh, okay. Yeah. New, ano yun, Gen, Z Gen, Gen Z. Z. Gen Z. Gen Z. So, explain to okay. us, Titos. So, from my understanding, it's a type of manipulative behavior mm-hmm. that men do to get the person hooked. Ah, oh, yeah. The sad so, boys. Ang oh, mga sad boys. <laughs> OMG. <laughs> OMG. So, you don't know the sad boys? Sad oh, boys. Yeah. Naglalaslas, naglalaslas. Hindi <laughs> naman. Dati, Di so, naman. parang naman 2014 <laughs> pa. Hindi <laughs> <laughs> pa. Hindi <laughs> ganyan. Hindi pa in that stage yet. Mm. Yung ginagawa nila. They'll try to show excessive attention, yeah. shower you with gifts, with compliments, mm-hmm. and then once they have you hooked, mm-hmm. wala na yun. Nawawala na yun. So, okay. um, you, you know when people shower you with so much attention, mm-hmm. you just feel obligated to uh, reciprocate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, yun yung ginagawa nila to control you. Mm-hmm. So, it's a, when everything is too perfect and too fast from the very beginning mm-hmm. of the relationship. Yeah. Okay. Love bomber yung tawag to. Love bomber. Mm-hmm. Usually seen in mga narcissists. Mm-hmm. 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 And sometimes men do it unconsciously. Yeah. Oh. So, how do you know if you spot the red flags in yourself? Question mo ba yun sa uh, akin? Again, medyo na ano ko din. <laughs> how do you know if you spot the red flags Uh-oh. in yourself? Tama? Parang, y- yan, so, usually kasi yung sinasabi mm-hmm. ko, it's, you never really date some, a toxic person. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's mm-hmm. just a person with toxic behaviors. Mm-hmm. Agree. Okay. Yeah. So, um, as a woman, for all you men, mm-hmm. <laughs> go. Oh, how do you make sure that you don't display these behaviors, or how can you tell that talagang toxic yung 
ginagawa niyo mm-hmm. in a relationship. Magandang Ako, tanong. Ano, because ay, sometimes ay, men are in denial and they don't like to admit. Ako may sagot po dyan. Ay, kailangan nila ako. Sagutin mo na. Sagutin mo na. Okay lang ba? Kasi hindi sila aware. Kailangan may mabantuloy ako. Tama siya. Actually, tama siya. Mission subconsciously talaga. Meron tayong mga ganyang behaviors or belief systems na hindi natin napapansin. No? At lalo na laki yung denial tsaka ayaw patalo dahil sa ego. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Siguro ako, ang andito is solution is authenticity. Mm-hmm. Authent- being authentic with yourself. Mm-hmm. With myself. Ganyan. And good thing with my ato, uh, relationship right now, mm-hmm. what or oh, how we started is really ano, starting off na wala nang ano, ano yun, stepping in best foot forward. Best foot forward. Yes. Mm. Na tipong we just allow ourselves kung magmamatch yeah. based on your yung apat na criteria mo. Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. then doon, parang kasi siya, yung girlfriend ko ngayon si Owen. Shout out kay Owen. Yun, yun. So, Shout ano, out talaga. Parang she's already, yung self-esteem niya, yung maturity niya mm-hmm. is already there. Na wala na din talagang ano, parang pag-fake and really ang tawag siya, authentic and mm-hmm. 100% na kung sino talaga siya, that's who will show up. Yeah. And same with me. Mm-hmm. Ngayon, when we came along, when we got together, ang nangyari is tingnan na lang namin kung compatible kami, kung may chemistry, kung mm-hmm. pwede i-commit. So with that, parang yung sinasabi mo na do can we avoid yung feeling na ano, hindi na maging ano to, ang tawag dyan, yung love, bomb, love bomber, ganyan. Mm-hmm. And wala nang mga mask to put to put up. And then, When it, when we came into the relationship, wala na din kailangang parang i-fix. Kung meron man sobrang minute na lang kasi we already know each other. Mm. Diba? Anong thoughts mo doon? Well, I asked that question because I wanted you to uh, give advice, mm-hmm. diba? To men who may not be aware that they have mm-hmm. toxic behaviors and how you see how you analyze it because it's how we might read it differently right yeah. mm. but for men they always analyze it differently too so mm. from the perspective lang of a guy i was mm. just ako That's naman for I me was. siguro i just want to add no for me kailangan happy ka alone happy ka sa sarili mo yeah. self assured oh self assured yeah. and hindi mo kinukuha or hindi mo inaano parang inaasa sa ibang tao yung happiness mo. Mm-hmm. Kasi for me, kaya nagiging toxic is because ito yung magpapasaya sa akin, partner kita, dapat bigay mo to sa akin. Yeah. Diba? That, those expectations. Mm-hmm. Ikaw ang pumukompleto sa akin. Oh, yan, Uy, ba? You complete ka naman. You complete me. Diba? <laughs> And for me, lalo na pag mga unexpected, ano pa, uncommunicated expectations Ayan. pa. Na diba? Bigla na lang mababad trip. Mm-hmm. Na, tapos kasi ito expectations ko, ito dapat, ganito yung ex ko eh. Ganito yung mm-hmm. mami ko eh. Mm-hmm. Diba? So parang kaya nagiging toxic yung relationship. So for me, dapat Not this for men naman, but kahit sino, kahit babae mm-hmm. ka or lalaki ka. For me, dapat ikaw happy ka on your own and hindi nakadepende sa partner mo or sa ibang tao yung happiness mo. Mm-hmm. Because for me, kung happy ka, naturally yung tao sa paligid mo magiging happy din eh. Mm-hmm. With your presence, kasama ka, yeah. lalo na lalo na kung maging ka relationship ka nila. Mm-hmm. Diba? Uh, uh, tingin ko ang sum- summary nito siya sabi natin dalawa is ano eh, come from self-love. Mm-hmm. Na buuin muna talaga yung sarili before you go into a, a, another relationship. Kasi, kapag buo na yung sarili, all of the relationships externally, even if that's a loved one, mm-hmm. even if it's a romantic relationship, you won't need anything from other people. And all of the things that's happening within those relationships are just bonuses. Jamari, mm-hmm. mm-hmm. ano, gusto mo magdagdag? Red flag ba yung ganyan? Hindi nagkasalita. <laughs> Walang ambal. Walang Kanina pa ako nagsasalita. <laughs> Ma orange flag. Orange Hindi ako flag agree. Oh, okay. um, kasi ano, parang most people, hindi talaga nila alam because hindi sila aware. Mm-hmm. Yan. And I guess, ano, going back to self-love, talagang ayun lang yung, ano, yung parang pwede nating um, panghawakan or gawin muna within ourselves para mm-hmm. yun din yung mag-reflect or yung overflow, ayun lang din yung makifeel ng ibang tao. Yeah. Might be in romantic relationship, Our family, our friends. Mm-hmm. So siguro, um, Tony, no, anong tip yung pwede mong ibigay uh, sa mga listeners natin? Mm-hmm. Okay. If you want to attract a successful, um, empowered woman like you, um, 
Ano ba yung pwede mong i-advise sa kanila? Ano yung mga green flags? Speaking of, yeah, ano yung mga green flags? Ayun naman. Yeah. Yung mga green flags, you know, I always say yung, yung green flags, it's relative for some people to Mm-hmm. Um, and I just one more question before I answer that. Mm-hmm. Sure. Do you think having a history of cheating is considered a red flag? What can I take a deep? Take a deep breath, lah. 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 <laughs> Sabarang galing mong ganda mm-hmm. naman. Sagutin mo yeah. muna yung Sagutin mo muna yung Napatake deep breath kayo. Ba't hindi mo naman eh. Change topic ka. Bakit nag change topic ka? Hot dog. Kasi ganyan ito. Ito ito. Tapasagot ka dyan. For me, hindi siya red flag. For me. Kasi ako... I believe... I believe the queen yan. Ako I believe na yung tao, nagkakamali sila, yes. Pero it doesn't define them. So, pwedeng magbago. Mm-hmm. No, siguro ako coming from personal experience, may mga history din ako ng cheating. And mm-hmm. <laughs> nagbago na ako. Tama ba? Oo. Yeah, yung parang you you separate, <laughs> separate, din direct, you separate toxic lang yan, direct, behavior from the toxic person. And yeah. 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 You separate toxic behavior from mm-hmm. toxic uh, and the person. Mm-hmm. Itself correct, correct. Because you can heal from that. I agree. Yes. Mistake. And and to hop of what what you said also. Um It is true because for me, kasi ba diba, before we enter a relationship, sometimes, panin kami mga babae sometimes, say, oh, what if ganito, mag-cheat to? Mm. What if magsisinungaling yan? Right. You know, but really for me, trust is all about figuring out if you can actually handle the situation mm-hmm. when the person does cheat. Because mm-hmm. for me, you can't really know eh. You mm-hmm. can meet the person at their best and then yep. magugulat ka pa din when they display certain behaviors right. like that. So, yeah, to also say, uh, just to also connect with what you said about self-love, mm-hmm. it's being able to trust that you'll know how to deal the situation mm-hmm. when it happens. Diba? Correct, correct. Self-assurance talaga. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Self-assurance. Yes. Ako, I don't believe in the concept of cheating, yung idea of cheating, pero ako, naniniwala ako, hurt people, hurt people. Mm-hmm. Yan. And maybe the reason why, again, hindi ako into the idea of cheating but maybe they are hurt before mm-hmm. and that is why hurt din yung binibigay nila with other people pero tama rin sila yun that doesn't define them yeah. maybe there is um, a time for a change or nasa process sila of healing mm-hmm. right right okay nasagot namin tanong mo <laughs> Thank you for that wonderful question. Thank you. Bakit ko yung nagiging host to? Ang saya dito sa podcast mo. Ang ganda. Thank you for inviting us. Yeah, thank you. So anyway. Then doon na tayo sa green flag. Green flag. Green flag. Ano pa yung mga green flags for you? Green flags in a relationship. Pag serious na ba? Or just when you're... Sa simula pa lang. Sa simula pa lang. Sa fling-fling lang muna. Start lang muna. Start lang muna. Um... I also look at three things to yung character ng tao. So, doon okay. napapasok yung pagiging gentleman, gentleman. matrismento, faithful. Yeah. Yeah, faithful. And then, for competence, that's where I try to look at yung intelligence nila. Whether that's emotional mm-hmm. or um, intellectual. And also yung adversity quotient nila. Mm-hmm. That's, that's what Totan I look yan. for too. And then third, of course, going back to the last stage that I mentioned, which is compatibility. Mm-hmm. And I think when you're more rigid about those standards, when you, as much as possible, stick to that criteria, Correct. then you'll be able to attract that person for you. Yeah. And you attract who wow. you are. Correct. Correct. As stated Correct. by Correct. Leo before. Because the standards that you're setting, you're just going to get into it. Right? That's Character, competence, and compatibility. Correct. <laughs> Triple C pala yun. Oh, C's. ano? Three C's. Grabe naman yun. Uh-oh. Napakaganda. And dating. <laughs> so, para sa ating mga listeners dyan, no, ng mga lalaki, make sure that you're able to um, develop no, a really good character. no, mm-hmm. um, Hindi lang sa pagdating sa relationship, but maybe in other areas of their life, di ba? Mm-hmm. And then, competence. Very important na hindi lang to basta matalino ka lang, but also yeah. your emotional quotient, your adversity mm-hmm. quotient, no? Um, up to date kasi syempre nag ano na ngayon yes. dami na ring mga nangyayari due to technology and other yeah. stuff no Correct. and lastly ano nga ba yung panguli nakalimutan ko compatibility compatibility ito kasi depende na to dun sa kunyari ikaw kung ano preference mo dun uh-huh. sa lalaki di ba so dun na to magde-depende so paano ba ini-improve yung compatibility mm 
Paano ba, Tony? So, let's say in an LDR relationship. Ayan. Diba? Sometimes, or, or let's say age gap. Okay. Sometimes, the two, as much as women prefer older men, mm-hmm. there are cases where hindi talaga magiging compatible mm-hmm. because you're both at different stages of mm-hmm. your life. Mm-hmm. Yep. So, no matter how much you want it to work, mm-hmm. kailangan, depende talaga on what you're willing to exert on in the relationship. Sino ba yung mga adjust? Mm-hmm. Or even when it comes to working, diba? sometimes people will say, they don't have the time. Yeah. But really, okay, you can also suggest. So, so what I'm trying to say is it's the effort that you put in to solve the problem. Mm, the gap yes, in yes, the compatibility. Yes, yes, right, that right. will okay. fix it. Mm-hmm. Pero if ayaw talaga, then... May pilit. Oo. Pag ayaw, huwag ipilit, baka dumugo. Tama. Mm-hmm. Tama yun. Mm-hmm. Diba? Right. Mm-hmm. So, magiging orange flag muna siya. For ah, okay. Time. For now. Oo. So, hindi kami kapatid mo totally orange flag. Oo. Hindi oh, oh. agad totally red. Hindi naman mawawala sa radar. <laughs> Kung nari nasa radar ka pa. Yeah, then. Kung magiging compatible ah. tayo in the future. We will see. We will see. Mm-hmm. Ang ganda. Only so, time will tell. Yeah. Okay ba? Wala nang pag-asa guys. Kung hindi ka, not so good looking ka, may mm-hmm. pag-asa ka pa rin. You know? Yung natin yun. Ah, yun lang, lang yung pinaka point. natutunan namin. Talaga? Sa video. Sa video. Sa video. Sa video. May pag-asa. Mga tatlong beses din na sinabi yun. Di ba? I guess continuously work on yourself. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Talaga yung personal development is the key. Correct. Yeah. correct, correct. Ganda ng Tony, no? Grabe. Uh, ngayon ko lang nakita tong side mo na to. Yeah. No, kasi mm-hmm. finances, basic na sa iyo yan, yes. eh. No? Talagang Easy. mastery mo na yan, mm-hmm. eh. No? Master mo na yan. But itong side na to, talagang nakita ko yung wisdom around it. Mm. And galing, no? Kung paano niya tinutwist na kami na yung oh. 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 Alam mo, oh. sobrang oh. looking forward ako ng, ng own podcast show mo. Yeah. I'm sure yeah. sobrang magiging maganda yan because magaling ka talaga makipag-converse. And yung mga questions mo, mm-hmm. Napapatay ka deep breath on trauma no. sa iyo, no? <laughs> no pa-isip eh, no? No pa-isip tayo. Hindi no pa-isip, parang tilamaan oh. eh. Yeah, so again, thank you very much, thank Tony, so much, for Tony. Um, dito sa pag-guest mm-hmm. mo, sa podcast namin. So sa mga naikinig sa Timawa Podcast na gustong mag-follow kay Tony, Tony, saan ka ba nila mahanap? So I'm active on Instagram, it's Antoinette Aquino, and on, on TikTok, it's Antoinette Aquino underscore. So, ayun. Yeah. Yeah. So, soon, makikita nyo na rin siya. Hindi pala makikita mo, ha? Papakinggan nyo na sa Spotify. Yes. Sure ako, yeah. no? Nabinyagay na siyang mag-podcast. Correct. Yes. And, uh, YouTube soon, no? For yeah. sure. Game. All right. So, thank you very much again. Tony, palakbakan natin si Tony. Thank you very much. Ang first guest yes. ng Timawa Podcast. So, kung nagustuhan nyo yung ganitong klaseng mga content, make sure to follow us on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Uh, subscribe na rin kayo sa YouTube channel namin for the video format of this podcast. And of course, you can listen for free on Spotify. Spotify. At so, Timawa Podcast. Yes, at Timawa Podcast. So that's it for this episode. See you again, guys, for another episode of the Timawa, Timawa Podcast. Podcast.